I think we will all hear about AI, machine learning, RPA, IoT, blockchain as some of the technologies that we should all be thinking about. Something like Metaverse gets discussed pretty much every event I've been to the last several months. And it's really intriguing to think about uh, this notion of virtual worlds and consumers that are creating uh, different avatars of themselves and outfitting them and personalizing them. Uh, that's definitely very interesting and has a lot of um, positive implications. So to start, I'm really excited about autonomous vehicles. And I think part of this might be because, be because I'm a civil and transportation engineer, but up to 96% of car crashes are caused by human error. So the potential to improve safety is of course huge. I think environment is going to be um, a big deal getting to carbon zero and what types of innovation will that spur as we go into 2023. And then another one that's not necessarily new, but still very interesting and gets talked about a lot is AI, artificial intelligence, right? That's something that is very prevalent as a, as a technology right now. Definitely AI, AI is becoming more and more and more mainstream and I, it's gonna continue to strengthen itself. As you see more videos and people talking to Siri and Alexa, uh, the incorporation of just voice and natural language is going to be critical. I'm also really excited about blockchain. I think that has the potential to just completely transform the financial industry and then with it, other industries as well. NFTs are related to that, right? And I know there's a lot of debate on the valuations with NFTs, but I think the underlying technology is potentially a game changer when you think about consumer engagement. People are trying to use it to do, to do things real time with blockchain technologies, though it's not completely mainstream yet, but there's lots and lots of, um, you, know, you know, applications and things that are coming out. So definitely that's a watch out for, uh, for the upcoming years. But the really interesting ones are the ones where there's the ability for the user to actually generate their own content, to personalize things and have that impact and actually let others interact with those same personalized things and, and, and content that that user is generating. Then I feel like it's almost this big web in that all these technological advances are interwoven and then each one facilitates others.